Hi, I'm Carolina with CTV, and you're watching The Perfect Quinceañera on MisQuinceMag.com. Joining me is Isabella Wall, the fairy godmother of quinces, and she's going to talk to us a little bit about the venue for your perfect quinceañera. So I know some people have in mind that they need to have it at a very formal place, like a banquet hall or a country club, but um, there have been some really inventive ideas that people have been coming up with lately. What have you seen? Right. Well, I like to say, let's give them something to talk about, because at the end of the day, people are going to talk whether your quinceañera was better than the neighbors, you know, it doesn't matter. This is your day, and you got to make it fun, and you got to be creative. So you can have it at a park, you can have it in your backyard, you can have it in your church's hall. It doesn't matter. It's all about using the imagination and being creative. Right. So you can do whatever you want. You just need to bring the decoration. in decoration elements. That's right. Well, for example, if you use the decoration and you you come up with uh, colorful ideas, mm -hmm. you can make any place look fantastic. Okay, what are some tips that you have for using decorations to dress up a location? Well, for example, you can use colorful shopping bags filled with uh, colorful tissue paper to make a centerpiece for a table, and that adds okay. color. Or you can use a big box covered with gift wrap paper in big bows to fill an, an empty space, and mm -hmm. that's another way to add mm -hmm. color. But if you want to be classic and elegant, you can have candles floating on clear water on a clear crystal base, and that's really elegant and romantic. And it's very affordable. That's right. So you can still you know, take any spot on a budget and make it look fabulous. Exactly. Some great tips. Isabella's got so many more tips. You just need to check out her blog on infamag.com.